the government is putting in huge amounts of energy to cover up its poor conduct instead of focusing on solving the country's problems, former Defense Minister Moshe Yalin wrote in a Facebook post on Tuesday will we have a leadership which presses forward with laws to help individuals in the government cover up their improper actions or a different kind of leadership? He asked rhetorically. Be the first to know, join our Facebook page. Function, D, S, I, D, Var, J, S, F, J, S equal D get elements patag name, S, 0, if, D get element beard, I, D, return, J, S equal D crea tealment, S, J, S dot I, D equal I, D, J, S, S, R, C equal slash slash connect Facebook dot net slash N underscore us slash all J, S number X, F, B, M, L equal 1 and app I, D equal 1, 6, 3, 4, 1, 4, 8, 0, 6, 8, 9, 7, FJS parent note insert before, JS, FJS, document, script, Facebook JS SDK, Yalin was slamming the Knesset's focus this week on rapid-fire hearings to get the recommendations bill approved and across the finish line. The bill will limit the public's access to police recommendations on whether politicians should be indicted in public corruption cases he noted that the opposition is filibustering the bill and that the competition over the bill between the coalition and the opposition has brought most other Knesset business to a halt while saying that he was not going to wade into the substantive debate over the merits and problems with the bill, he said that the government's obsessive focus on the bill is problematic and is leading it to ignoring crucial issues to the average citizen the former defense minister said he moved a program forward to close up and transfer military bases in the center of the country in order to make areas available for more affordable housing, a regular problem for much of the country. When asked if this compromised the country's security, he said that he had responded that housing security is part of the country's security, again implying the government is ignoring this issue among others on Saturday night, Yalin headlined a 600-person rally at Zion Square in Jerusalem, intended to be an alternative pro-demonstration supporting the country's institutions, as opposed to the anti-corruption tone of the protest held in Tel Aviv for the third consecutive week he criticized the current leadership as corrupt and divisive, saying, this is not leadership. Leadership should unite, not divide. Politicians are turning topics such as integrity into left and right issues Ya Allen then said that in the past, when asked what keeps him awake at night, people expected him to say I ran. But I answered, corruption. Corruption causes the common citizen to lose faith in our leadership and in the country's institutions, he said. It is a bigger danger than the Iranian threat, Hezbollah, Hamas, or ISIS. Gil Hoffman contributed to this story. Share on Facebook Share on Twitter Tags, Nesed Moshe Yalin Corruption in Israel Corruption